for today's Nintendo Direct. I'm Yoshiaki Koizumi, and I'll be your guide. I have lots of information to share about upcoming games for Nintendo Switch and Nintendo 3DS. Up first, some Nintendo 3DS headlines. It's the biggest collection in this microgame series. The latest in the WarioWare series is coming to the Nintendo 3DS family of systems. Which means, there's a new way to play Wario's strangely satisfying microgames. With classics and new additions, there are 300 microgames to enjoy, making this the biggest entry in the series. Press buttons, tilt the system, use the touchscreen, and microphone. Only hey people. Mario can come up with this many control schemes. Think fast. What play style is required for this one? Better figure it out and dig that crazy action while it's hot. Hey, some familiar characters are rocking new looks. This I got like scratched by the cat right before I uh this was about to start. Just look at that face. Even Ouch. Mario can contain his wicked grin. WarioWare Gold launches August 3rd. Why? Get ready for pulse-pounding post-apocalyptic oh, races and battles. Race down enemy Groks and rock them in battle to defend frontier villages. Yep, this yes, was sir. on the 3DS. Action meets tower defense in Dylan's Dead Heat Breakers. It's like the third one in the series now. This time, the Red Flash himself, Dylan, will team up with your own animalized me character. Be strategic and use your whole team. What in tarnation? Okay. Your friends and characters can join the team as gunners. You got new well, you'll need their help to face each wave of transforming monsters. That was a good game. Who or what will you and Dylan get tangled up with? Never mind that. There's an enemy invasion to stop, and a frontier in desperate need of some heroes. A demo version so they changed the up the gameplay. That's pretty awesome. Yeah, that was a kind of a tricky game. The whole game, Dylan's Dead Heat Breakers, rolls into Nintendo <sighs> eShop on Nintendo 3DS May 24th. Oh, so it's a little different. A little bit. But why are, are they talking about games that are coming out in May? Usually together. directs are focused on what's coming out the next Nintendo couple DS months. Classic Mario and Luigi, Bowser's Inside Story, is back for more gut-busting adventures. <laughs> <laughs> Mario and Luigi have been tasked with finding a cure for the Blorbs. A disease threatening all life in the Mushroom Kingdom. My but hurts. thanks to Fawful, both brothers have been devoured oh, by yeah. Bowser, and so their journey takes them deep into the belly of the beast, leaving Bowser to scour the kingdom for the cure. The only way forward is to change between the bros and Bowser. The big bad will even beef up for monstrous boss battles fit for a king. Take him down in this action. Okay, that's RPG. cool. I don't know why people are saying where's KYF right here. And so the webcam not uh -oh. Looks like his boy wants in on the action. Find out what happens behind the scenes in the untold story of Bowser Jr. Yeah. When Mario and Luigi, Bowser's inside story plus Bowser Jr.'s journey launches in 2019. Okay, that's cool. Here's the scoop on Detective Pikachu. Knew it! Plus a new Detective Amiibo. Pikachu. Something about this Pikachu is a little different. He's gruff. You agree with me, don't you? Runs his mouth. Hey, don't boss me around. Likes coffee. This high half life is as delicious as ever. And no one knows why. <sighs> Welcome to Rhyme City, where humans and Pokemon usually live in harmony. He sounds like Danny DeVito. Yeah, he but doesn't recently, sound like himself. Pokemon he doesn't sound like Ryan Reynolds. And running amok. Well, luckily, a boy named Tim and Detective Pikachu are on the case, facing each mystery head on. A quick attack! Oh, oh. How was that? Did I do it? Yeah. As of today, the game is available for pre-purchase in Nintendo eShop on Nintendo 3DS. When's it come out? Crack the case with Detective Pikachu. Yes! The launches March. March 23rd. Plus, keep your eyes peeled for this extra large Detective Pikachu amiibo figure, which launches the same day. Why is it so big? What's the reason? That mysterious mansion has reappeared I in the Nintendo know. 3DS remake. They're doing a remake of the original Luigi's Mansion. Mario. GameCube one Nintendo looked better. Nintendo GameCube classic Luigi's Mansion has been remade for Nintendo 3DS. 
What? What? I uh, love the original, though. This Fans is the 3DS. The Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon game can now explore the original mansion where Mario went missing. Luigi's something of a scaredy cat, but these classic ghosts and traps are no match for his vacuum cleaner. Besides, the mansion's map will be displayed on the bottom screen. Nice! New if you work up the courage, fight the ghosts of your past battles in the new boss rush mode. <laughs> I love the original Luigi's Mansion. Nintendo Mansion. 3DS launches this year. This year, okay. That's all for Nintendo Get 3DS. Up. That's it! Okay, what? switch. So far, so good? Well, let's keep the headlines coming. It's time for Nintendo Switch. I hate that I Kirby can't snap. Kirby can even make friends with those characters? Luke, why aren't you snapping? Kirby's Star Allies finally launches. We're doing week. that game. As you fight snap. through your Ow! Oh, sorry. Was My hands. I'm just trying to help you out there. Legacy characters can become Kirby's she got friends. both of them? Well, yes. three friends anyway. Sorry. When you're saving the world, it's nice to have some heavy hitters on your side. Even the likes of King Dedede, Meta Knight, and Bandana Waddle Dee. Bandana Waddle Dee is back. March uh, 16th. More dream friends will be added to the game via free updates after launch. So, you heard it here first, guys. We're doing Kirby Rick, Star Allies Pine, and, Coup. and uh, Detective Pikachu this month. That's such a weird name March. to give your children at birth. Bandana is a first name. And Gooey. This looks so fun. It's like a dream come true to bring this ragtag crew of characters together from across the Kirby series. Kirby Star Allies launches on Nintendo Switch March 16th, and the first free update will be available March 28th. Oh yeah! Nice! Quick reminder, a free demo is available now in Nintendo eShop on Nintendo Switch. What else I don't have room. For? And it's also pre-purchased uh, pre available. With new yeah. artistic touches. Okami, what? The grand adventure in classic I didn't see Okami coming. Rises again mm, I want to play Bird. that. May as well. To save the land from a terrible curse. The legendary Okami Amaterasu was resurrected, setting off on a quest. Okami was a great game. Artist, I've never Isu. played it. Overcome challenges it's using the power of the gods, the celestial wolf. brush. With mere brush strokes, you can make a variety of miracles game. come to fruition. In the Nintendo Switch version, Use touchscreen control in handheld uh -oh. mode, or use the Joy-Con controller's motion controls in TV uh. mode or tabletop mode. I was gonna Both say, if it was touchscreen, you couldn't record it. Oh, right. Use use the brush cast. like you did on the Wii version. Solve mysteries oh my gosh. and slay countless monsters to discover what awaits at your journey's end. Okami HD launches on Nintendo eShop on Yay! Nintendo this, e summer. this summer. Okay. Yeah. yeah, this is not too painful. I have to jot that down. Eat up and throw sushi on Nintendo Switch. An adventure unlike any other. With conveyor belt sushi action, it's Sushi Striker, the way of Sushido. The story takes place after the bitter sushi struggles. Raised Whoa. in a world where sushi is forbidden, Musashi must wage all-out conveyor belt sushi battles to defeat the I like Empire that it's an anime. It's kind of like Food Monopoly. Wars. Mm -hmm. Oh, it's sushi! The is deep, but the basics yeah. are simple. Just eat more and more sushi to pile up plates of matching colors on a table. Then throw them so all throw plates at people? Mix up your strategies oh, to crush your enemies. Game. If you manage to pull off a special move created by one of your sushi I like the cutscenes. You may be able to get the upper hand in battle. Yeah. Of course, there's a multiplayer mode yeah, too. I mean, we could Battling do fellow Nintendo sushi strikers like online can get intense. It's not too long. Sushi Striker: The Way of Sushido launches simultaneously on Nintendo Switch and Nintendo 3DS June 8th. That's got to be based on an anime or something. More travelers, more details, and more launch info. Yeah, when's it coming out? Hello, this is Masashi Takahashi from Square Enix. Today, I have three news items to share with you. First, I'd like to introduce two more main characters. What that sweater lies looks so comfortable. Meet Tressa the Merchant. She sets off to find her own adventure and gain experience in her job. Her path action is Purchase which means she can obtain special items from townsfolk. I helped out someone in a bind. Simple as that. And this is Alfin, the apothecary. 
he embarks on his journey to heal those suffering across the continent. His path action is inquire. He can worm out info others aren't privy to in standard conversations. Next, let's talk about jobs in battle. Characters start out with a base job, but they can equip an additional job to use in battle. For instance, if another character like the Merchant Tressa equips the Dancer job, the combined jobs and abilities expand your strategic options. I liked that game. Yeah. It was supposed to come was, out this spring, though. The game was really good. The only thing that I Finally, felt weird about was the girls' you know many of you have been wondering about the release date. Yes! The game launches July 13th. Oh, July. Ah. Uh. That's well, Additionally, than we will be offering a special edition of the game. Inside, you'll find a pop-up book introducing the eight characters and their places of origin, a helpful map for your adventure, a sound selection CD, and a replica coin based on the I don't know if July is a good time to release an RPG, though. This special though. edition will be released the same day as the regular version of the game. Your comments have provided the development team with reference points and inspiration as we head into the home stretch of our work with the game. Please look forward to the release of Octopath Traveler. So Octopath Traveler had two delays, and now it's coming out in July. So, what ouch. They when should sell that sweater as enters the game world. accessory to the game. The legendary yeah, we won't be console. doing this game on this channel. But <sighs> Travis strikes again. Into the game world and embarks on a rampage of epic proportions. Inside, there's an action game, racing, puzzles, a total of seven different game titles. With his bean katana in hand, what did they do to no more to heroes? Every last bug he finds. Chain his simple yet exhilarating basic attacks and his arsenal of skill attacks to cut them down to size. A brutal boss lurks at the end of each game. Wait, this isn't No More Heroes. Combine your moves to crush them. This is like a beat em up now. There's a, a tiger there. Controller to a friend for co -op multiplayer. And this is different. This is a different No More Heroes Batman. game. Did we mention the adventure mode, which tells a new story? Travis Strikes Again, No More Heroes, launches exclusively on Nintendo Switch in 2018. Sometime this in Dark year. Souls, every challenge is an opportunity. Plus amiibo. Plus amiibo. I love how they're like, plus amiibo. Dark Souls. A world wrought with despair. <sighs> and a hope. world wrought with high blood pressure for gamers everywhere. I know, right? Where Namco hands you a little squishy yeah, skull. Yeah, for stress. Oh, I missed another spot now where you I can got savor cut. your accomplishments uh, anytime, anywhere, for the first time on console. With Nintendo Switch. Before launch, there's going to be a network test, so players can try the game. If this Ooh, Dark Souls I'm excited about that. I love Dark Souls. What is the test? They're basically a network the test is like an open beta. Will be released. With it, uh, you the popular "Praise the Sun" gesture with reckless abandon. Dark Souls Remastered. So you and get an amiibo to do amiibo that. That guy on looks May like. 25th. That guy from Mon Monty Python. Where it's, it's they... Dark Souls. Yeah. How's it going so far? Well, I have a quick reminder. No Metroid. Did you hear that my Nintendo members can now redeem gold points for digital games and DLC on yep. Nintendo Switch system? Just choose to use your points during the checkout process in Nintendo eShop or Nintendo Switch or on the Nintendo website. Visit the My Nintendo website to learn more. Okay, we have more Nintendo Switch headlines, but first, let's shine a nice long spotlight on one title in particular. Mario Tennis? Please, take a look. Ah, he didn't snap this time. Yep, call it! I'm psychic! <laughs> I'm excited about this game. I can't believe you're psychic. Let's a go! Yahoo! There are more than 15 playable characters, each with their own distinct characteristics. The varied play styles on the Love Nintendo Mario Switch Tennis. system allow up to four players to step onto the court together. I don't know four players. Today we'll mainly cover the essentials of the refined You could have some neighbor play. children to come by. <laughs> There's a variety of shots to serve That'd be up. creepy, though. Like a you better bought back my super moves. 
like the Slice? exaggerated super moves. That's what you need and a lob in a Mario sports game. How could anyone we'll play tennis on the grass like that? It would never bounce. You can't beat me in Mario tennis. <sighs> Why not aim You've tried. Then shoot. I thought I was pretty good at it. Introducing the all new zone shot. What now? What are you doing to my tennis game? Any spot you want to aim at using motion controls and send no! Crashing down. No motion controls. Boo! Zone shots are really powerful. So if you get hit by one, your racket will take some My only hope is that you get the motion controls messed up and can't if figure out how hits, to do them break. until we've already done like 20 matches and then I've beaten you. They better let you play the regular <laughs> way. <laughs> Oh, you can break their racket now. No, Luke, Nintendo's about innovation. Why would they let you play the way you've always played? Because they've always done it in the Mario Tennis games. Alright, if they have a normal way. Alright, so basically, so people can't, like, school you, they had to add break racket and blocks. Okay, that's cool. When using zone speed, the world around you moves in slow motion. What? No! No! No, 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 no. Mario Matrix. Dodge. Yeah, they made this more accessible. Boo! Dodge the snare. <laughs> Ruined my Mario Tennis, Nintendo. <laughs> Luke, they can't allow people to have the kind of skill that you have at Mario Tennis and continue to win. Boo! I actually wrote them a letter and I was like, my husband continues to beat me. Can you do anything about this? This was their response. If a ball gets away from you, you can jump over to I felt my hype deflate. I feel better. Maneuver. If you don't judge the timing or still going to beat you. You may waste your energy or lose a point. But if you're successful, uh, I think it froze. That's what being successful is. If you're successful, Nintendo. Initiate your ultimate shot. Nintendo, you're frozen. You want me to check the comments? Hang on, it's frozen. You want me to see if people are watching? There are people watching. Not even a special shot guarantees a win. There's always a chance it could be blocked, so watch out. In these intense matches. Every move you make presents a risk and hopefully a reward. Your energy gauge could be the key to victory. Will you use it for an offensive zone shot? What? Stop doing that. Somebody thought you were talking about Kibro when you said Travis point, strikes again. Will you try to destroy your opponent's racket and run the risk of getting blocked? Non-stop, split-second strategies may be the best part about Mario Tennis Aces. Um... Rejoice. Yeah, it's not so you can also play using simple No, no snow. Which means only basic shots are allowed. No so rules! Online, you can play a match with your friends Come or other people players. in the chat. Events and online tournaments will be held allowing you to compete against other players. Why well, I have a handicap now? During the event. As a participation bonus. As you should. Shame on you for constantly beating me over and over again. Anyone who played online. I know. Actually, I told you not to go easy on me. Now, if you would have played oh. motion control mode. This mode is perfect when you want to play the game casually with your friends and I played a cool tennis game with Sylvester the Cat. A long time ago. I think it was on the Sega or Super Nintendo. Sylvester the Cat? Yeah, it was a Looney Tunes tennis. And it was Sylvester playing it. I don't even know if they brought back the uh, awesome moves, so I don't think so. Story mode? Okay. I'm down for a story mode. Mario Tennis Aces launches June 22nd. Everything's coming in June. Oh, and one last thing. As we approach the game's launch, we decided to hold a pre-launch online tournament. That way, Whoa, you, you should do that. Mario Tennis Aces for yourself. Aces, Charles. At a later date, so please stay Aces. Tuned. Aces, Charles. 
We'll have more on Mario Tennis Aces in the future. Let's continue with some Nintendo Switch headlines. Does anybody know if Camelot is the one that's developing this, or if it's Nintendo? Because Camelot was the people who made uh, Mario Tennis. Other systems. Captain Toad Treasure Tracker is bound for Nintendo Switch. What? A variety of tricky sandbox style levels. Another uh, Wii U port. Box garden called Hakoniwa. You can rotate the camera and touch the screen for a better view of hidden treasures. Man, Nintendo is trying to cash in and on their uh, this time, we've their Switch. A few Super mm. Mario Odyssey levels too. <laughs> now you can okay, so it's Captain Toad with Super fingers. Mario levels. Odyssey. New Dog City. But in their defense, the Wii U sold terribly. Yeah, no one's. They said I think it. Chrono says I think it's Nintendo. Nintendo Switch version can be played with by sharing a pair of Joy-Con controllers. Say Camelot was amazing. Mario Tennis. The other can assist with things like turn up cover fire. No, I'm gonna give it the benefit of the doubt. I think it'll still be a good game, but they definitely made it way more accessible. What? Burgess's man just add a few levels. Is he talking about this or the? Captain well, Toad. Captain Toad Treasure, Tracker, Treasure Tracker is coming out in July, and it'll be for the 3DS and the Nintendo Switch. It was originally on the Wii U. Hey, who turned out the lights? Wait, this game's still alive? I don't know what it is. It's a text-based game. At least I think it is. Oh, this is where you have to find your switch. No, it's not. Oh, it's Undertale. Oh, it's Undertale. Ah, okay. Undertale. Yeah. Yeah, people really liked that. Undertale. Well, I mean, that would give us a reason to do it, but I don't know if... Coming eventually! <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> what?! The impossible isn't possible until I didn't see this coming. How could it come to the Switch? Games are debuting because it's not exclusive to Sony very first time. anymore. Because it's owned by Activision. Through the trilogy's hundred plus action yeah. platforming levels as Crash. Did not see this focus. coming. Everything Switch gamers, prepare to rage! <laughs> Luke, are you going to be going through this again? No! The original games. You should so do a, a stream on monitor or something. On the go. No! Ruin Dr. Neo Cortex's plans for world domination and save Tana in Crash Bandicoot. Form an uneasy alliance with the mad scientist in Crash yes. Bandicoot 2, Cortex I Rice love Captain Crash. Toad 2, Leo. And stop him in the evil Uka Uka through a battle across time in Crash Bandicoot 3, Warp. Believe it or not, the Crash Bandicoot Insane Trilogy is we officially never got that making far. the Wump to Nintendo Switch July 10th. Well, the developers said they made it hard on purpose. Never fear, little nightmares. They made it harder. Here. They made it their true vision. From award-winning independent developer Tarzier Studios comes a charmingly horrific adventure like no other. Namco loves horror games, just like Capcom. I know. I'm surprised this one's uh, coming to the Ma, Switch. A vast vessel of mystery oh, haunted me. by corrupted souls. The complete edition on Nintendo Switch contains two haunting tales in one package. It's a cute little person in a raincoat. Six and the kids' separate adventures. Looks like you must Paddington. face their childhood fears across all eight chapters, including all past downloadable content. Each room you okay? is a cell. Yeah, Each resident here. is a threat. Okay. And both present complex 3D puzzles to master. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know how long if I should like you mention, keep doing that before. <laughs> <laughs> the Nintendo Switch I'm fine. exclusive <laughs> in Paku mask by tapping the Pac-Man amiibo figure. So you're a cat dad. Little Nightmares Complete Edition releases on May 18th. I never understood the thing about raincoats because if you buy a raincoat, you can only wear it when it's raining, but not South when it's Park cold. It doesn't give any Nintendo warmth. Switch. What? We're excited to announce <sighs> that South Park: The Fractured But Whole is coming to Nintendo Switch. From the creators wow. of Star Wars comes this outrageously offensive superhero adventure that you can play anytime, anywhere for the very first <laughs> okay. time. Okay. Customize your avatar. Not counting on that. Come on down to South Park and join Stan, Kyle, Kenny, and Cartman's superhero team. Then have yourself a time with a battle system as surprisingly deep as the show that spawned it. Ah, oh, you just let him hit you. Choose a class, level up, build your notoriety, craft items. That was a big game last year. All past DLC will be actually six months ago. Switch is actually getting pretty quick. People are saying pass. this one is in family friendly. DLC I don't know if they're talking about this game. one or the one before. 
both games. Those, <laughs> we don't look at every Switch game, people. Only uh, E through T. We won't be doing South Park, no worries. Yeah. Or the other one. I think the other one is supposed to be pretty horrific, the fractured but whole releases on Nintendo or Switch April 24th. Exactly six months after it came out. So yeah, Switch is getting ports really fast. Maybe Hyper not Warriors horrific, but, you know. Launches when exactly? Let's take a April. quick moment for a release date announcement. April. The heroes and villains of the Legend of Zelda series are about to spring into action once more. This spring. That was a great game. Hyrule Warriors Definitive Edition launches what? the 18th only on May? You have nothing in April. Wow. Arms fans, don't miss this. Boo. The Arms League is pleased to extend an invitation to all you hardcore oh, fans wow. out there who've been playing the game, enjoying all the added characters and stages, oh, and going have online to play the that. new Party uh. Crash mode. We're happy to announce the Arms US and Canada Online Open. Prelims will take what? place in the game's online ranked match mode from March 8th to March 18th. That's Eight not top gonna... players will then move on to the online it's a tournament they're announcing. First. I all can't. finalists will receive a custom art piece created by the win. development team. We'll be streaming the event live from Nintendo of America headquarters on Whoa, our official site. Nintendo's Stay tuned for our social like channels for more details in the box. coming weeks. And if you're not an ARMS fan just yet, well, we have good news. On March 31st, we'll be hosting a three-day test punch. Download this demo event from Nintendo eShop on Nintendo Switch. Play for free. <laughs> Worst purchase of last year <laughs> for me. I still wanted to try On March it. 21st. <laughs> Producer Kosuke Yubuki will discuss the development of ARMS at the Game Developers Conference. Uh, and Hisashi Nogami cool will on. present separately on the Splatoon franchise. I don't know if this is really necessary we'll for, for a Nintendo both. Direct, though. It's kind of a commercial for a tournament. Kind of defeats the whole purpose of games. Isn't it's that what a Nintendo time. Direct is? An entire commercial for all their Nintendo stuff? No, they're Nintendo games. This April, Splatoon 2 is getting an update. Version 3.0 is coming. Here's a brief what? and briny taste of what's to come. It's just new stuff new in games, so gear. new gear. Fresh looks, just in time for spring. You have to buy a new game? No! It's an update. Oh. Plus, they're just showing you all the stuff they're adding. Just start at level one again? No. Blonde. Camp Triggerfish. And the hottest date like spot for the hippest inklings. Blonde. Wahoo World. <laughs> and what? Rank X is here! Uh oh. Rank X Evelyn's gonna go world. crazy. Yeah. Even higher Rank than X. Plus. More details are coming soon. <laughs> Once you meet certain conditions, Cali will appear in Octo Canyon. Whoa. Wait, they're adding more to the story? The world of yeah. Splatoon 2 continues to evolve, so don't miss out. Yeah, because it was just Marie before Cali was gone. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Oh, something's wrong with the TV. Ah! Now, a word from the Squid Research Lab. Check out their latest video. <laughs> Thanks for the subscribe. Yeah, I think this is more story mode. Whoa. Looks like Black Widow. So this is what... They want people in April to play. Oh, new hairstyles. Squid hairstyles. Uh, okay. Another game mode, I don't know. New York City subway, I don't know. Yeah, this is so what it's like in New York City subway. Only the fittest survive there. Basically, everyone doesn't survive one train ride. It's so dangerous. Notice how they're showing like this. Which is gay. Uh, can we get to the point? What's going on? I don't know. It looks like a story mode. Freaky. More bosses, more yeah, more story yeah, mode. Yeah, it's more story mode. More more story mode. Okay, this is something they haven't done before. 
kinds of different squid faces now. Unless... Octo! Wait, you're saying you could be an octopus now, maybe. Octo expansion. I guess so. I don't know. Hello. Squid Research Lab here. So, how was it? You just got a sneak peek at the first paid downloadable content for Splatoon <laughs> Ah, paid downloadable content. Single player mode, Octo expansion. <sighs> I like You'll his play as the outfit. new character, Agent 8, who looks like an Octoling. She wakes up on the platform of a dark subway station without her memories. Looks like some kind of shady underground test facility. In this massive subterranean world, there are 80 of these test facilities connected by a subway. Wait, how many? 80? You'll depart from the station with purpose. A variety of missions so. await Agent 8 and her talents. Expect new stories to unfold, shedding new light on beloved characters. You may think you know everything about the world of Splatoon, but these waters run deep, and so does the lore. Escape from these twisted depths, and you'll be able to join multiplayer matches as an Octoling. Whoa. We hope you enjoy this fresh perspective. Since Octa means 8 in Latin, that means 2018 is the year of the Octoling. Hmm. Splatoon 2 <gasps> he made an eight. expansion will launch this summer. That's After today's cute. Nintendo Direct, Splatoon 2 Octo expansion will be available for advanced purchase in Nintendo eShop. With this purchase, Splatoon 2 owners will immediately receive Octo-themed in-game gear to use in battle today. Thank you, Squid Research Lab. Hopefully, Splatoon 2 will continue to splatter our expectations. <laughs> That's you just bet. so weird. That's all for today's Nintendo Direct. Aww. Well, actually, we have one more announcement. Metroid! Please take a look at our last video for the day. Metroid! I'm gonna save it for E3. Toki Tori. No! What? <laughs> Like Wait, this is Splatoon again. Yep. Yes, it is. Look. Yes, it is. Oh, there's the original Splatoon 1 Wii U. Yeah, that's Splatoon Wii U. No, 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 no. Don't port this. There's no reason to port this. Why would you port the first Splatoon? The second Splatoon is a port of the... What? Smash Brothers? ARE YOU SERIOUS?! Well, ouch. What? I don't remember what that symbol is. <laughs> Nintendo wants to make money. Hardcore. HOLY CRAP! WHAT?! WHAT?! S switch. Uh, what? December. <laughs> I'm gonna guess it's December 2000. It would have to be December. I'm gonna wait all year. You're gonna oh, think okay. you're gonna think it's any month, and it's okay. Not. All right. Hey, thank you for watching. Wow. Yes. <laughs> Do a little bow or something. Yeah, but how is? <laughs> I mean, Sakurai isn't doing it though. So who's? It's a port. It's just a port with new characters. This is the K Wings watching Nintendo Direct coming directly to you. Yeah, whatever. All right, people. So that's it. Uh, <laughs> no Metroid. Yeah. Wow, that's uh... crazy. So the uh, they're joining the cast of Splatoon. That's <sighs> what. Yeah, thanks guys for watching, and let us know what you think of all the games, and they didn't really, they didn't really give very many games, I don't think, but maybe we'll do more Nintendo, let us know if you want to see more Nintendo Directs like this, and 
To the person wanting our Switch friend code, uh, I don't have it with me right now, but I believe it's on my Splatoon streams if you go to my channel and I have it listed. All right, yeah. Nintendo Switch, I mean, wow. Um, are there any other streams later tonight? No. Um, we have to do stuff. Yeah, I have, like, like, I have not been feeling too well, so I haven't been able to stream as much, and, but yeah, but I am able to, like, record episodes sometimes and stuff. Yeah, so we're, so, we're finishing Sword Art Online tonight. That's, that's what yeah. would be happening, like, in fact, I need to go back into the game and grind a bunch. I'm only a level 68, something like that. And to beat the game, I need to be at least a 75, yeah. 80, something like that. I'm just, oh, yeah. I'm only doing the bad or the good ending. I'm not doing the true ending. I'm telling you guys and gals that right now. Um, the Monster Hunter Story stream is tomorrow. It's not tonight. Uh, oh. We did the Nintendo Direct thing instead. Pe people were sad they did not uh, see Pokemon. Yeah, there was, well, I mean, you had Detective Pikachu. So, yeah, I mean, that was yeah. Pikachu, you guys. Had somewhat Pokemon. You guys said a little bit of Pokemon, I guess. Mm -hmm. People thought it was awesome. Kitty X-Men thought it was awesome. I was very surprised by Smash Brothers. And I was not expecting that Ch at all. Chihuahua -wa says, yes, Smash Brothers was cool. I mean, and it just goes thanks. by what I've been saying for ever since that guy took over for Iwata. This guy, he loves ports. He likes, um, you know... <sighs> It was it was kind of crazy. Yeah, so, I mean, I don't know. I mean, I like the, that you can play as an Octoling. I don't know if I'm going to make it that far to be able to get through all those Octo levels to be an Octoling. I think I know someone who is going to do that. Actually, a lot of you guys um, that play it, but I was thinking, obviously, Nintendo Cade will be Octoling, will be out there as an Octoling. I'm surprised. I mean, <laughs> they don't really have a lot of games that are coming out in April, though. Metroid, they're saving for. I guarantee you, they're saving Metroid for. Um... Ow! Sniper already. Okay. They're saving Metroid for um, E3. Guarantee it. That's that's too big for a Nintendo Direct. That'll be a Nintendo Direct at the Yeah, other one. Chrono says I really want to get Fatal Bullet. Yeah, the Fatal Bullet is really Yeah, Fatal Bullet is really good. Oh, you're showing it right now. Oh yeah, I'm just grinding. I forgot. I, I was gonna shut the stuff off. Oh, that's okay. Well, but yeah, I was I was very surprised. Out. Yeah, you guys can tell us what. Okay. Yeah, I think we'll just be on here for a few minutes, and Luke's just, just gonna, gonna say be here his on thoughts. A few minutes. I mean, the Smash Brothers thing, it was crazy. I was not expecting that. Uh, neither Crash, but... The the Crash stuff, I mean, you know. Not crazy. But the Smash Brothers thing? I mean, as soon as I saw that logo, I knew it. Because, I, kn I mean, what were they going to do? I, I understand that this Nintendo president is the king of, like, ports. I mean, we got um, Tropical Freeze coming out in April and uh, some other stuff and it's i don't know i mean now with captain toad and uh i understand the wii u didn't sell well but at the same time it's like it's almost like the wii u was a complete mistake because most of its games are on the switch it's like what <laughs> as a company you just have to wonder like what the heck oh Pretty much all the exclusives that were popular for the Nintendo Wii U are coming to the Switch. That's that's crazy. I just I don't I don't know what to say about that. But anyway, guys, I'm gonna do some grinding uh, so we can finish uh, Sao tonight. Um, thanks for watching the Nintendo Direct. I hope you guys had fun, and um, I will see you people tomorrow with the Monster Hunter stories. And I believe. It's not definite, but I think we're doing Final Fantasy XV uh, as a live stream tomorrow for our friends over at Square. Um, they did ask me to do it, but the game is 160 gigabytes. So, oh no! I got wrecked. Yeah. Uh, yes, I agree. Um, yeah, Ryoko is saying I think they put all their uh, characters into Smash Brothers by now, maybe.
No, not all of them. We have well, a lot of them. I, I need guess. I need Mach Rider and I need some other you stuff. You need Mach Rider. I got. It. Did you guys try playing Knack too? No, I hated Knack. Um, we tried playing the first one and I didn't really understand it very well. And I then I didn't like it. I didn't get the second one. I'm sorry, but a lot of people like that one. Oh, thank you for the virtual hugs, Xterlina. But yeah, that's uh, it for the Nintendo Direct, guys. Thanks for watching, and yeah. um, I will see you guys tomorrow with Monster Hunter Stories and probably Final Fantasy XV. Yep, thanks so much for watching, Just guys. Just the first hour of Final Fantasy XV, because that game is going to be massive on my desktop. Like, which I'm not going to Yeah. So, yeah, and I'm, I'm going to come back with my streams as soon as I can, but... I've just been really tired and um, had a lot of doctor's visits recently, so not I'm not gonna, this. yeah, but um, yeah, I'm probably gonna either take a nap or practice my piano, but I'm probably gonna take a nap because, yeah, yeah, I'm just becoming a cat. <laughs> Alright, so you guys have a good one, thanks for watching, and uh, it was fun, like, uh, maybe we'll do more, like, webcam stuff or, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, like, this isn't too jarring, like, doing it just for 30 minutes. No. Basically, I just pretend that no one's watching me. Yeah, but in the comment section below, tell us uh, what games you were excited about and which games you were, like, uh, totally stunned by. And I'll see you guys later. Stream is done.